Hi, welcome to Balliol. This is Hollywell Manor, part of Balliol College. Uh, I'm Thomas, I'm a DPhil student in particle physics and also the MCR president. Hi, um, I'm Ashna, I'm a second year DPhil student in immunology. Um, and Balliol's grad community consists of around 350 students um, from over 40 countries. This is the graduate bar. We keep it open so people can just come and tick off when they want to take something, uh, which is a really nice system. It's a very trusting place here. Uh, last night in particular we had a cocktail evening because it was Halloween, so some of the freshers brewed up some spooky cocktails. Uh, it was a really nice event. So this is a TV room uh, slash like study space. Um, it's more of like a cosy room in the manor. We like regularly host film nights and Thomas recently acquired a VR set. Yeah, um, it's a lot of fun. But yeah, so there's like gaming happenings here and that doesn't make sense. Gaming. <laughs> it does, gaming happens, yeah. <laughs> gaming happens here and uh, yeah, this is a TV room. I guess this is the way to the MCR. Um, on these walls is the history of Balliol. Um, yeah, so that's what these like paintings. Here, right, and then goes around like this. So I believe John the Balliol kidnapped some monks for reasons that I'm not oh. sure why. Um, and then this is him Sweet. being flogged for it because he shouldn't have done it. Um, so we think this is him. You can see the clothes here match the clothes that he's wearing on the hill there. Uh, and then he gets charged for it and he has to make, pay lots of money to the crown. And uh, that money is used to found the college at some point. That's <laughs> over here. Over there. Um, they look, people look happy there. Yeah, I think that's because they're, they're now on their way to Bayonne. And then they're studying. And they're studying. <laughs> and the, the chains are for the books, not the scholars. That took me a long time to realise. Yeah. Um, this is just another great study space, um, yeah, on the way to the MCR. So this is the MCR, um, which is the centre um, for the grad students at Balliol. Living together with so many people here and all being at the same college and feeling part of the same community, it really encourages people to kind of get involved. But if you do feel like you have a family, it's one of the reasons I applied, because I knew that they had an active MCR, um, and that was true, not just active, but just super welcoming and supportive um, and there's always people about to just chat to and that's a great help especially during the PhD. <laughs> this is now the residence only part to keep it on the DL that we brought you here. This is called the cockpit. Um, it's like another social space that's kind of less grander than the MCR so we hold a lot of game nights here. There's a projector which you can hook up the games consoles to. Recently had Halloween film night. Yes. Yeah, two days ago. Watched the original Wicker Man. It was very odd. Interesting. <laughs> um, yeah, we've recently redecorated the, the walls as well. So we found the, well our women's officer found these po portraits on Etsy uh, and we did a poll around the MCR for which ones, which people the MCR would like to see on the walls. Um, and then we added a, a ninth one for the founder of Balliol, uh, Lady de Virgo. Um, so that's why she's like the big one and then surrounded by the little ones. I Thomas I drew that. To, I didn't want to big up myself too. Thomas much. actually drew that one uh, and then we got it printed. So, credit to our president. Yeah, thank you. Hi, <laughs> Multi talented. Yeah, I drew it and sent it to her and then she got it printed off. Because um, funny enough, it didn't have Lady de Virgo on Etsy as an option. So, <laughs> yeah, but it's we felt that needed to be amended. <laughs> So, this is our lovely garden. So in summer it becomes like a really lovely social space. We've got the barbecue at the back, around the corner. But yeah, Thomas lives up there, so he overlooks the whole garden. I mean, you live over there, so you also overlook the whole <laughs> garden. Like, I can see your window from my window. <laughs> that is true. Yeah, so all of these are student rooms or kitchens. Oh um, yeah, exactly. It's really nice. So there's a lot of rooms in the manor, you get a nice view over the garden, you can see what's going on. I think that contributes to the whole like community family feel of the place. And this is the main site of Balliol as opposed to the grad centre where we just were. Um, here you have another gym, uh, there's the JCL bar, there's the dining hall behind us. Um, there's just lots of things where grads can come and use them here as well as in the manor. And also main site's really not far from Hollywell Manor, um, like a few minute walk. So yeah, pretty convenient. So just through there is the Bale Library, the um, main set library, and it's open 24-7 with individual desks and also some uh, communal ones. Um, so yeah, the library also has like a grad specific space, which is really useful. Another shout out to the gardeners. Like, yes. <laughs> the, the, the gardeners are always pristine. They're just, they, they are. Like, in summer, the, they, they're always um, in full bloom. That, that's, it's pretty really good. Uh, This 
this is the Balliol Dining Hall. It's where I eat most of my dinners while I'm here. Um, it's just a, it's a lovely place. You just go through, get your food, and you can sit any of the tables. Uh, it's nice to have somewhere to come each day and eat with your friends. It kind of keeps you within the social circle and stops you getting too isolated with your work. And there, are, there's formal hall on Tuesdays, um, but it's not a super um, sort of formal affair. It's semi. Like yeah, it's semi, not strict yeah, formal. You can wear yeah. whatever you want, basically. Uh, but the food's good. The food's really lovely. Uh, it's, it's nice. Yeah, to have our chefs here. They're so good. So like the MCR puts on a lovely formal meal every time. So it's like Christmas, dinner, Burns night dinner and May dinner. And they're so much fun. So um, the entire MCR just comes and has a great meal and a good time in all. Recently we celebrated 40 years of women at Balliol and so we've added these portraits um, around the room where they got people, well women from Balliol who are either MCR members, JCR members, rowers, staff, uh, and they put them into groups, took pictures, and yeah. uh, it's really nice. Ashna is in one of them, <laughs> but she doesn't want me to say, so I'm going to say now, it's over there. Uh, um, thanks, Tom. That's right. <laughs>